Hey kittens! Silver here with yet another unboxing video today. I'm here with Beatnik, the Douglas cat, and he's here to help me greet the new arrival, which is going to be yet another Douglas um, kitten, because I'm always on the lookout for, um, for retired Douglas. They're so hard to find, and when they do come up, um, you really just have to spring on the spring on the opportunity and not let it pass you by so um, so I found this on Mercari and um, I'm really excited to see how she looks in person so luckily this is going to be a nice easy access because uh, the tape was very loosely kind of just loosely taped on all right so let's see how Luna looks Tissue paper. All right. I see her there. Ooh, she's soft too. She's another one of the floppy style plush, I believe. But um, I believe she's going to be more in a sitting pose. So let's see. Okay. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. She's even cuter than I thought she would be. Look at that little face, that cute little round face. She's so perfect. And look, she looks adorable with Beatnik too. And she even has her tag and everything still intact. It's a little, a little creased, but still really nice. Okay, that's Luna, the gray cat. And let's see her tush tag right there. Oh wow, she's she's so soft and squishy. So yeah, she's a little bit more of a more in a sitting pose than Beatnik. Beatnik is a lying cat. Um, she kind of wants to. Well, I guess you can kind of. She's floppy enough where you can put her into a lying pose too, but that's kind of nice where she can also sit upright if you'd like her to. And she's got sort of a, I would say, uh, not exactly a gold eye, sort of, maybe almost, maybe like a darker gold. Kind of similar to Beatniks, I think. Well, yeah, they're almost, they look almost identical, I think. And I love this color gray too. It's, um, it's almost got like a slight brownish tinge to it as well. But it's so soft. It feels like it's barely ever even been been handled before, which um, is really nice. And she's got uh, the plastic whiskers, I'm kind of pointed upwards a bit, as you can see here. And the pink plastic nose. She's got the little white around her muzzle. Oh, and she's got this cute little tuft of white fur. Not a tuft so much, it's not a... It's, it's the same length as the rest of her coat is. Um, and she's got the cute little white paws. And her tummy's the same gray, uh, gray color as the rest of her coat. She's just really cute. I mean, she she wasn't exactly like a grail plush, so to speak, but she was kind of one of my uh, in search of plushies. Um, and I probably would have looked a lot harder for her if I knew how adorable she was in person. She is so sweet. I just love her. So she's probably about, um, about 12 inches, about the same as Beatnik here, I would say. Let me see, it's kind of for comparison. Yeah, so they're almost, uh, yeah, pretty much the same. She might even be a little bit, yeah, she might be a little bit bigger than Beatnik. But I'm, this, Douglas is always nice, too, because uh, they already come pre-named, so I don't have to rack my brains and try to come up with something myself, which is not something I'm very adept at. Um, wow, she's really, really cute, though. I'm so, so happy that I um, managed to snag her when I did, because Douglas cats go fast when they get listed. So, um, so yeah, she's going to make a very, very nice addition to my little Douglas cat collection. Uh, which I hope to continue to grow and expand. 
um, over the coming months. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed Luna's big reveal and I will see you guys next time.